In this video, we will see how to define coils. But before we do that, let us go ahead and hide the air geometry so that it is easy to access the coil geometry. To define a coil, you can right click on the coils folder and select wound coil. First, we have to select the components that comprise the coil. So let's go ahead and select the coil component. For the entry port, we have to select a cross section face. So I'm going to right click and select other. Now this allows me to select the cross section face through which the current goes. As far as the exit port is concerned, please select the same as entry port option. If you do the show preview, you can actually see the direction of the arrows showing you how the current circulates in the coil. Next, we will go to the general properties and then we will select the number of turns to be 40 and then we will select the current per turn to be 1 amp. Let us hit OK and thus the first wound coil is created. Let us repeat this step for the second coil. So we right click on the coil, select wound coil, we select the second coil, then we go to the entry port and then using the select other command, we click the face through which the current is circulating. For the exit port, select the option same as entry port and then show preview will show you the direction of the current. Make sure that the direction of the current is the same in both the coils. Then we say OK and thus we have defined the coils for this problem. 